Uh, welcome back to Game Quest. I'm Mike. And I'm Tony. And we made an interesting discovery off camera. Basically, uh, after we completed the Decker Tree, we were forced to turn off the game, walk away from it for a bit. No big deal. Nothing serious. Uh, but when we reloaded the game, we loaded it in in Link's house. So, uh, Mito is standing there ready to angrily confront us about uh, killing the Deku Tree. I say we blame him and skip town. Yeah, I'm gonna agree with that. <laughs> Dude, if you didn't want us to kill Tree Dad, maybe you shouldn't have made us go strapped to a casual get together. <laughs> These things sword. happen. Before we leave town, though, uh, real quick, how about you go up there real quick to the uh, Lost Woods? Okay. The uh, entrance to the Lost Woods being at the top is hill over here. The Lost Woods are actually a uh, Zelda franchise tradition. And I think this is the second or third time in the series they came up. Huh. Anyway, there's a cool gimmick to uh, being able to traverse the Lost Woods that uh, I'll explain to you later, but for now, just go right. Alright. And the reason for this is because there's a thing you can do here, and that is you uh, aim at that log. Alright. And aim towards the center, get a bullseye. A little high. Yeah, there we go. I figured I'd just get Tony to do this now, because there's literally no reason not to do it now. And it's something that could... It's not that hard to overlook. Yeah, three perfect bullseyes. Gotta give a neat present to such a wonderful person. Was that just in your skull? Okay, so, uh... I'm not sure Deku Scrubs have hands, but it's do. weird that he was just, like, yeah. filleting it. Alright, we'll get right on that. Should we be going? We should. This was a weird detour. Go left. All right. It's faster to get lost in the forest than it is to go out the proper way. <laughs> Jump off the cliff. Remember, if you forward a roll, you don't take damage. Ow. Okay, try not to concuss yourself in a brick wall next time. Uh. Go, go, go. Maybe they'll just think we died helping the Deku Tree. No one saw us, right? Except for everybody. <laughs> No one saw us. Clean getaway. Shit. Ah. Oh, okay, so sorry I just phased in like a ghost and caught us before we managed to slip away. I mean, this is actually an interesting thing. Uh, from what I remember is, um, originally, like, uh, the reason the fairies were given to the uh, Kokiri and the reason we became a thing in the first place is because they wouldn't, lo they couldn't get them to load in properly unless you were within a certain distance of them in this area. Huh. Partially because of all the particle effects, so the fairies were there to kind of help you figure out where everybody was. And then the whole, like, them fading in and out thing just got incorporated into lore for the entire series. Like, uh, I think in Breath of the Wild especially, the Koroks, which are kind of like a Kokiri offshoot, sort of. It's weird. Um, get surprised when Link is able to just see and talk to them, because th you're normally not supposed to be able to do that. Oh. And it has something to do with them being blessed as, like, children of the forest or something. Well, that's interesting. Yeah, no, I, I super love it when they're able to basically uh, creatively incorporate uh, creative, uh, like, limitations into something. Like, um, one of the things that sticks out to me is in uh, the first Terminator movie, uh, Arnold Schwarzenegger, who is playing an evil killer robot in the movie, uh, spoilers. <laughs> Uh, gets damaged in the face, and they have this scene where he, like, goes and does, like, an impromptu, like, surgery thing on himself to, like, get it out of the way, and it reveals, like, the evil glowing red robot eye. But they couldn't just have Arnold Schwarzenegger running around with an artificial implant, and the CGI didn't exist, and the budget for Terminator was basically zero dollars. <laughs> so what they did was they put had him put on this pair of sunglasses... And they had, like, I think, like, a small eye patch with an LED on it or something. So, like, if you look closely, you can see, like, the <coughs> the evil glowing robot eye hmm. in the background through the sunglasses, which was super neat. 
and kept like the continuity of the scene going and everything. Huh. I love when they do things like that. Anyway, um, <laughs> Link's been standing here staring off at nothing, thinking about killer robots. <laughs> Let's acknowledge our childhood friend. <laughs> oh, okay. Maybe we shouldn't just try to leave without talking to her. And nearly leave the forest someday, Link. I didn't think it would be after you killed the Deku Tree. <laughs> I wasn't expecting you to commit fat fratricide and then dry and bail. <laughs> uh. Because you are different from me and my friends. Um. All right. So, like, what? We're we're not included. I mean, we did just kill the tree, Dad. Yeah. I guess that's fair. I guess that's kind of a reason to exclude if anything is. It's forever, won't we? Awkward phrasing, but okay. I'm down to still be friends. Yeah. You were basically the <laughs> nicest person here. How'd you have this ocarina? Please take good care of it. Sure! I mean, I'll have to pick up a trade somewhere in the outside world. I had to leave all my tools behind. Yeah, that's true, isn't it? With this, I can hustle street corners. <laughs> you see the fairy ocarina. This is a memento from Saria. Okay. You can equip it and then play music. Come back to the forest and visit. Awkward. So yeah, I mean, yeah, that was kind of like uh, our limit for social interaction for the day. He literally Hi, looks friend. like he just decided to bail out on everything. <laughs> yeah, just like, I hope you'll come back to visit. Fleas. <laughs> Fleas in obvious terror. <laughs> oh, God. Girls and social interactions. My two weaknesses. I can barely speak. I like a giant owl. <laughs> Wait, what? You not see that gigantic inverted looking pine cone above this trail? No, I totally missed that. Yeah, anyway, social introvert or whatever. Uh, maximum social thing. It'd be, it'd be great if like we didn't talk to anybody else for out, oh, goddammit. <laughs> Here, looks like time is finally come for you to start your adventure, Hoot Hoot. Oh, wow. That is thoroughly distressing. You will encounter many hardships ahead. That is your fate. Do not feel discouraged. Even during the toughest times, Hoot Hoot. <laughs> You're really not helping me out, Mr. Owl. <laughs> Go straight this way and you will see I will castle. Hoot Hoot. You'll be the princess there, Hoot. You'll like her, she's a Hoot. Um. <laughs> you lost no, no way to mm. Go look at the map. Yeah, you're a dungeon too late for that tutorial. <laughs> the areas you've explored will be shown on the map. Press start and other subscreens. And press LRR to find the map, Hoot Hoot. On the map subscreen, you will see a flashing dot showing you which way you should go next. Did you get all that? I'm more than happy to repeat my life story if you didn't. <laughs> Alright then, I'll see you around, Hoot Hoot Hoo! What the God, God, I love being an owl. <laughs> Why did a giant owl just interrupt my adventure to basically speak tutorial at me? <laughs> this feels faster. If you went straight, you could probably get there before sun now. Like, you started going in a straight line rather than diverting like that. Yeah. I could probably make it, right? Maybe. I mean, hope springs eternal. Yeah. It's not impossible. Crazier things have happened in this world. Haha! <laughs> 
I've made it in before nightfall. Nice. What's up, mister? Welcome to Hyrule Castle Town. Cool. Sweet. Nice, peaceful town. Nifty. Ah, I can go in here. Well, this is a fine mess you've wandered into. Feels like this room is trying to tell me something. What about you, sir? Are you going to tell me something? Man, I'm so bored. I think it should be interesting if there were more troubles in the world. Hmm. That's a fascinating request, my friend. Hey, this is between you and me, okay? Okay, I can keep a secret. Let's do by breaking these jars. I have a better method. Oh? Just go wild with your sword. That is much easier. Sir, there's a lot of money in these. So, fun fact. Did you know the uh, the uh, giant monster things that run around in Breath of the Wild look like giant pots? No, I didn't. They actually, actually resemble like a, an ancient like form of pottery in Japan or whatever. So it's kind of a subtle joke or whatever, where it's just like the pots are having their revenge upon Link. Huh. There's no reason. You can't get that money from here. It didn't even drop money, you're a fool. <laughs> However, there is something you should do before you leave. Yeah? See that crate in the back? Yeah. Break it with your face. Other crate. Kill the golden spider. Take its soul token as your own. Uh, okay. Treasure. Haha. <laughs> Let's get out of here, we got a princess to talk to. Right. We actually have a job, don't we? Ooh, another door. Can I go in there? No. Ooh, look at this bustling place. Beard thing is a shop. I'm not sure what the potion thingy is. You are so handsome, just like the King of Hyrule. Hee <laughs> hee. Oh, you are more beautiful than Princess Zelda. Oh. Okay. How are they spinning like that? Are they just standing each on two halves of like one of those little hoverboards? Hmm. <laughs> <laughs> slightly <laughs> rotating in place this or not. This beard is my pride and joy. Okay. What's in here? Oh, hey, it's a shop. Oh, hey, it's a shield that isn't crap. Hmm. Don't buy the shield. There's a better time and place for this. Oh, hey. You've been to Lon Lon Ranch? Their milk is delicious. There are many horses there, and the young daughter of the ranch owner is cute. Oh, that's nice. Unfortunately, I'm lactose intolerant. Hmm. Okay. I'll keep that in mind. Oh, hey. You look weird. Yeah. Huh. I wonder what that place must look like. Nothing here we can buy, we don't have bottles. Yeah. 
My precious little puppy's fur coat is very special compared to the other mutts around here. Okay. Sure thing, crazy lady. Oh, hey, look, she's adorable. Clothes, they're different. You're not from around here, are you? Yeah, we... <laughs> we just got here. <laughs> just kind of rolled into town. <laughs> oh, you're a fairy boy from the forest. My name is Malin. My dad owns Lon Lon Ranch. What a coincidence. We were just told that you were adorable. The rumors were true. <laughs> the castle over his milk hasn't come back yet. Oh, that fairy had fixed him right up. That's how you know he's a real man. Uh, uh, is there anything worth doing in town, or do you want to just go ahead and go to the castle? Uh, There's a shooting gallery, but I think you get a piece of heart if you're good at it. Ah, okay. Take the time and enjoy the heights. <laughs> Here's Highway Castle. Take the street on the right. If you want to see the back alleys of the town, take the street to the left. Hmm. Okay. What are we going to find down the back alleyway? <laughs> Ah, oh, a drug dealer. On to the castle. Alright. I was expecting something more back alley than just a single drug dealer. This way, right? Yeah. It's a pretty lame back alley, if you ask me. Oh god, it's the owl. But did I miss him again? He's at the top of the tree. Oh. Yeah, his head is upside down. <laughs> it looks disturbingly face-like still. <laughs> the princess is inside the castle just ahead. Be careful not to come for all the gods. Hoot, hoot, hoot! On this crowd, time flows normally. <laughs> Put time down still while you're in Lon Lon Ranch or in a town. Why? Don't ask questions. <laughs> if you want time to pass normally, you'll need to leave town. You'll never be able to sleep where it's safe. <laughs> <laughs> Well, well, which way are you waiting to go down? You want to hear what I said again? No. Are you sure? Okay, who? You're a smart kid. Good luck then, who, who. Okay, let's do this bit quick. Okay. Go wrap the vines. Oh? Go slightly to the left so you can actually climb. Stop hitting A. I'm not. I don't know what was going on there. Alright. That's a guard. Do I go down? Uh, just run up to the guard. Hmm? Get him mad. Okay. Ow. Why am I actually hurt? That was a pretty singing voice. Welcome, Hyrule Castle Town. It's a peaceful, prosperous town. You get <laughs> one of your fellows just literally threw me off the bridge up there. Yeah. Welcome to Hyrule Castle Town. <laughs> it's peaceful and prosperous because if you're a troublemaker, we break your knees. Oh. Go ahead and talk to her. Talk to her quickly. Go to the castle, fairy boy. Just want to find my dad. Just want to sleep somewhere around the castle. We get to prank her dad. Oh, sweet. Oh, yeah. If you look for him, I'll give this to you. I've been incubating this egg very carefully. Don't ask how, tee hee. Okay. You got a weird egg. Get back up that vine, soldier. That's part of why you were on a time limit. Uh, okay. If you got to her before dawn, otherwise you have to wait out an entire day-night cycle. Go to the right where the vine you can climb. Remember where you climbed up last time? <laughs> why is it just kicking me back down? Don't know. All right, so... Uh, Jump off. 
I'm just going to guide you through here because it's super easy. Okay. Okay, now uh, turn left and run up this hill at an angle. Now cut straight across the lawn and climb up that brick thing on the, on the hillside. Oh, okay. No one will ever know that I'm here. Run straight off that hill and jump into the moat. Swim with the current down to the corner. Get out of the water here. Pass into the corner. Aha! Uh -huh. Okay, now you see that sleeping old man on the ground? Yeah. Go ahead and take a second to pause the game. Okay. Oh, Jesus, Lord, I keep again. forgetting. And, uh... In the next episode, I'm gonna want you to whip your cock out and startle him. Um...